Hi guys, this is Connie. I have got a Shop Miss A haul for you. I went a little nuts. And they have a lot of new stuff on their their site, so I thought I would try some of it out. First things I got were, um, they're not what I thought they were, so they are going to go to my granddaughter. But they are um, headbands. See, I thought this, you know, the pictures, I don't know how they can make the pictures look so different from what they actually look like. Um... And I got this one, which is very pretty. I might use this one. I don't know. What do you think? I'm having an extremely bad hair day today. We'll try that one. Okay, so I got several things here to talk about. The one thing about Shop Miss A, I tell you what, they are meticulous about their packaging. They package things in this um, styrofoam stuff, and then they package it in bubble wrap. So it is so protected. I'm, I'm really pleased with their stuff. Um, first thing I got, which I don't even remember getting this, um, is a long wear lip liner pencil. And I don't use pencils. I don't know why I got this. Um, it's Mauve Lux, which is in my color. and But I'll try it. Maybe that's why I got it. I decided I'd try it. I don't remember getting it, though. Um, I also got some of these eyebrow razors. I don't know for sure um, how to do this, but I'm going to try, I think. They were only a dollar. And the next thing I got is, um, this is a under-the-fingernail cleaner. It's a metal deal that you just slide under your fingernails, and you can clean under them a lot better. I like that. Um, I also got a pair of socks. These here, I thought I would try these. Um, I've had socks like this in the past that just slid down my feet, but I've got a couple pairs of shoes that, that are just slip-ons that I don't like to wear socks with, but my feet get so hot in them and then they stick to them and stuff. So I thought I would try these socks and see if they work. Okay, I got some fingernail polish, which I don't normally do, because I don't normally do my fingernails. Until, see, I just got my fingernails done a week ago, and once this, you know, I have acrylic nails, once this grows out enough where it looks kind of goofy, then I file them down, and I um, take this polish off, and I paint over them to last me a week or two. And I thought, well, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try this. So this one here was just so beautiful. It's clean color, and it is in 128 Orchid Chrome. But look at that. Isn't that pretty? It's got the, um, I don't know whether you'd call them, I guess you'd call them kind of glittery, but they're so pretty. That color is just to die for. Um, then I got, I thought this was so pretty. This is a, um, this one here is a, Orchid Chrome, and just a nail lacquer. And this one here is a opaque matte. And this is in Savvy Pink. But this here I thought would, you know, was just more of a natural, um, neutral color pink. I just thought that's so pretty. Okay, the next one I got is, I, I stepped on the bandwagon, guys. I see everybody wearing this color, and I just think it's so pretty. And this here is a just a nail lacquer, but it is in 101 Concrete Gray. Isn't that pretty? And then this one here I thought was more of a gray, but it's more of a green color. And this is an opaque matte. And it's mellow khaki. Khaki. Sorry, khaki. Khaki. Um, it looks almost more green than it does... But I thought that would that they kind of go good together. I thought this one this one here could be on on this finger. I don't know. We'll have to see how that works. Okay, the next thing I got was something really weird, and this is a clean color eyeshadow primer matte. And look at it. Comes in a long. So I'm going to try that. I mean, all this stuff was only a dollar, so I'm not out that much. And what what really kind of pisses me off about them is 
I don't think their their lipstick colors are true at all. Um, I'm going to quit ordering lipstick from them because I can't get the colors I like. None of the colors that I, I thought I was getting are the right colors. So, especially this one. This is in Ro Rosta? Rasta? Um, I thought it was more of a mauvey pink. And it is... This one here is going in my giveaway. I'll, I mean, not my giveaway, my, my swap stuff. Look at that. I'm not very happy with that color at all. I can just imagine. I'm not even putting this on my lips. I'm just going to swatch it because I can imagine what that will look like on my lips. It's not going to look good. And Anyway, this was um, a Muse matte. And these are matte lipsticks. Um, this one here is better. This one is Classic Rose. And this one here is a lot better. It's still not what I thought I was getting. But um, it's a lot better than the first one. This one here I'll keep. So those are Amuse. Those are brand new. And this one here is a clean color. Madly Matte. And this is Brick Rose. Which... Okay, come on here. Get rid of that. Well, maybe not. I don't know if I'm going to keep this or not. We'll see. Yeah, this one's okay. This one's actually very pretty. I like that one. So one out of the three I didn't like at all. But I don't think their colors are true to, true to form at all in their lipsticks you guys tell me what do you think do you when you choose a lipstick are you always happy with it or do you think the shades are off or um i really appreciate it when websites do lip swatches because you can actually see what it's going to look on, on like on a lip not just in a tube um i like that a lot anyway that was my shop miss a haul if you like this kind of thing please give me a thumbs up let me know what you thought of everything in my haul. Um, if you've gotten any of this stuff, what you thought, what your thoughts are on the lipsticks. And I will talk to you soon. Bye-bye.